Welcome to tutorial number 158. In this tutorial, we will talk about the next command in Sheet Metal Sketch Sheet Bin. And we will go straight to apply this feature with an example. And then we'll see some cases how to deal with the Sketch Sheet Bin. And then talk about the advantages of Sketch Sheet Bin and compare it with the base flange. Start a new part, part OK, and we will draw a shelf hanger. I will start from the front plane and draw a triangle. And let's give it some dimension. and add relations fillet the down corner and make place for holes so it'll be easier to save some time we can make the holes already here So this is the basic sketch of the hanger and we will mirror this sketch. Make this for construction and mirror click on this to uncheck it and the mirror about this side. Go to the sheet metal base flange and make it a thickness of one millimeter. Click OK. So now we have this flange. And now we'll see how to bend it with the sketch it bend. So sketch it bend is a feature to bend some sheets. Fillet these edges. Feature. Fillet them. So now we can bend this hanger with the sketch it bend feature over here. So to use the sketch it bend, click on it and you will again get two options as we talked about in the previous tutorial, similar to the jog. So you should be familiar with this. So directly I'm going to pick the face and here Solid works will start a sketch to draw a bending line. Click normal to and the line you will make it in the center of this this flange. 
when you are done exit and SOLIDWORKS will ask you about the bin parameters this is the fixed face similar to the jog and now you will see you are able to bend it and here are the options which we already talked about inside outside and I will just keep it in the center of the bending line and here you can make it with an angle so I'll make it 89 and for the hangers you notice that the the radius is a bit bigger so you can override the value to type 10 okay we can click ok and the hole we can make them a little bit down so let's make this sketch it bend sometimes when you can get uh, complicated faces or boxes and you need to bend some edges and it can be difficult to meet it with the edge flange so this this feature is flexible that you just can draw a line and bend wherever you want and also one advantage with using this sketch it bend that you will get a smooth edge over there if we flatten because we already draw that sketch and we see it is smooth and when you exit you will notice the edges as well are smooth and let's compare it with the base flange so if you would like to make the same shape with the base flange it can be done because this shape is kind of simple but in some detailed sketches when or in some detailed places where you need some bends you cannot made by base flange but let's try to start a sketch for the base flange in the right plane and draw a 90 degree the sheet metal this flange mid plane and we said the the radius is 10 millimeter okay and here is the first step and then to create this triangle you need to cut over here and then again another step over there and another thing the cut here is on an angle so if you would like to cut this side and then this side you will not get a smooth edge as in the case of the sketch it bend because the shape the original shape of the sketch is made and then bended and now let's see another case where the base flange cannot make it so we will make a partial sketch it bend go to the original sketch edit we will create a tab to support this hanger so I will draw corner rectangle and define it some dimensions
and create a tab cut like this construction offset entities one millimeter offset verse okay and close the cut And now exit. You will notice that this tab is already bended with the sketch, but I wanted to keep this straight. So let's see how to do this. You can edit this feature again, go to normal two, or we can start again to show you how it can be done. Suppress so this feature. To give it a chance to be vended, we can extend that cut. Make a similar. Undefined. Make this construction. So we extended the cut. And now let's try to keep this straight and see and start the sketch it bend. And line from this side to this side. It said the fixed face is this you can select one of these options when you are done click OK so here you can see that we could partially bend this hanger and this cannot be done with the base flange 